this. Come on, get this. All right, all right. So here's the deal. You you don't know what you're doing here, do you? No, sir, I don't. Okay, and uh, let's start by who are you and what do you do? Uh, my name is Ben Brownell, and I am the principal at Roxbury Village School. That's right, and you have no idea what you're doing right here. No idea whatsoever. And I'm trusting you, sort of. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. <laughs> We are going to do something called sub three minutes. It's a great way to get to know you, um, welcome you as part of the team, all that jazz. I'm going. I have a series of questions here, and I'm going to ask you those questions, and you have three minutes to answer all of those questions. Okay. If you go over, there's no real penalty, but that's the game. That's what we're trying to do. Do you understand the rules as they've been explained to you? Yes. Okay. Here we go. Where are you from? Cambridge, New York. Share a time you tried something that didn't work and what you learned from it. Oh boy. Um. <laughs> it's always the stumper. Yeah, it is, it is. It's great. It is. Um, I would say, um, my goodness, you really got me on that one. How about uh, the time that you did sub three minutes and couldn't answer the second question? Yeah, that was what the you, hardest what are you one. Learning what, from what, it? what am I learning from it to uh, um, open my brain up a little bit more <laughs> and explore my thoughts? Next question If you were a Star Wars character, who would you be and why? to be Luke Skywalker, right? Save the galaxy. Absolutely. Okay. What's the biggest opportunity for schools today? Biggest opportunity? I guess to just take students of all backgrounds and kind of really bring them in and uh, education is a great leveling play, play um, field uh, that you can balance uh, and get everybody the opportunity. That's what uh, I would look for. Do you believe in Bigfoot? Um, no. <laughs> I have a Bigfoot cast right up there. We can talk about this afterwards. Um, favorite non-school thing to do? I would say exercise. Running, weightlifting, those types of things. Crunchy or smooth? Smooth. Where do you find your best ideas? Colleagues. I would say observing, listening. What's your favorite book? I really enjoy Charlotte's Web. Always read it, always read it to my third graders. So, one of my favorites. What's your most unusual talent? Unusual talent? Whoa. Yeah, it can't just be a talent. Uh, it can't just be a regular talent, an unusual one. Um, you know what? At the end of every school year with my third graders, shirt and tie and everything, I'd always do a cartwheel for them. Sounds like a promise. <laughs> we're going to have to see some proof of that. Um, if you were a superhero, what would your superpower be? Oh, I I'd love to fly. That'd be great, right? Yeah. Is a hot dog a sandwich? Why or why not? No. It's not a sandwich. Why not? <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's not bread. Well, it's bread, but it's a, it's a roll, right? Yeah, I don't know. It's a, it's a different category of a zone. But you're saying it's not a sandwich? It's not a sandwich. Okay. And you put mustard on a hot dog, not ketchup. I just want to clarify that as well. One goal you have for this year? To better connect with the colleagues not only in my building but also abroad at uh, specifically at UES. How do you make time for reflection in your practice and you have uh, approximately 15, 14, 13, 12? Uh, well, uh, journal writing uh, and also speaking individually with colleagues uh, so they can give me some feedback and uh, at Central Admin as well for feedback. Nailed it. All right. Nicely done. Ben Brownell, Roxbury Village School principal, new colleague working on some trust issues because he didn't know he was coming in and doing this. <laughs> Look at there, though.